Dansby and Jorge go back to back, for some reason my eyes went to you standing right about here, jumping around like a little kid. Yeah. What's going through your mind when you watch that unfold there? Uh, well, Snit and I were both, when Jorge hit it, we were screaming, get up, get up, get up. A uh, little Bob Euchre in us right there. So uh, I, I've never wanted a ball go over the fence so bad in my entire life. And that perfect, that was a perfect moment. You also got, I, I feel like we've been talking this whole postseason about, you know, the next man up. Yeah. And tonight you got four and two thirds of one run ball from Kyle Wright, who last pitched with you guys in June. Yeah. And tonight, along with your night shift, who held everyone scoreless once again. Yeah. How do you even describe what this pitching staff's doing right now? Uh, it's very hard to describe, but um, it seems like every single night someone new is stepping up huge, and that's what it's been like all season for us. And what Kyle Wright did in Houston, and that confidence he got striking out the side, he carried it over. I mean, no one was expecting four and a third from Kyle Wright tonight. We thought we'd get a couple innings, and he exceeded everyone's expectations. He was just pounding the zone. It was unbelievable to see him go to work tonight. Do you think it's because you went in and fist bumped him and told him? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think so. <laughs> I think I think that man got some confidence in Houston. I mean, if you wanted to take credit, no, for I'm it, not, you I could. would never take credit. Uh, that was just an amazing performance by him. Last but not least, yeah. one win away from the World Series. <laughs> What's going on in your head I right really now? I really don't have any words. I think my face says it all. So let's let's get it done in front of our fans tomorrow. Sounds great. Enjoy this one, Freddie. Thank, Thank you. Kelly. Appreciate it.